X-Men 87 here bringing you another short. Today we're looking at the DC Multiverse Bane Mega Figure. Bane's head sculpt is utterly insane from the paint to the venom tubes attached from his venom tank on the back. Hands down the best Batman villain in the 90s in my opinion. I love the uniqueness as his look evolved from just a luchador to a militant looking luchador. <laughs> Gotta show support for my fellow Latino characters. The paint apps all around are pretty sweet and I do wish the tubes were a translucent green to add some realism to the venom. The sculpting is phenomenal as it tells a story with his veins being pumped from the venom. This figure shows true character energy. Only downside is the articulation isn't the greatest and also he didn't come with fists. Oh, the flesh tone isn't painted underneath the glove. That sucks. Here he is next to the Storm Collectibles in Justice Bane. And here he is next to a Moffix Batman for a comic comparison. I'm rating Bane a 8.5 out of 10. These mega figs have been great, but it's relying too much on sculpt and needs to add more articulation and include accessories because something's got to give for the high price point. Still a great figure, but could have been greater.